Hello everyone, I'm going to go right ahead and show you how to partition a hard drive uh, using the command line. Now as always, uh, you will need to have the command line um, basically elevated. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to type in disk part. There we go. And we're going to go right ahead and list disk. Alright, so uh, like, all, like last time, um, you see disk 2, which is the one that we want to go right ahead and partition. So um, I want to do, I'm going to go ahead and select it, select disk 2. And I just want to uh, point this out. So if we do list disk again, you notice how there's a star. That means that disk 2 is selected. So just so you know uh, where you're at, you might want to just, you know, just, you know, double check and make sure that you're in the correct disk. Um, just so you don't go into like let's say you know let's say disk uh, disk uh, zero uh, that's where I have all my data and if I do you know a clean on it um, yeah that's gonna be that's gonna be uh, you know that's gonna be gone <laughs> so just FYI I just wanna you know let everybody know all right so we we uh, we go right ahead and select disk two so the next thing we're gonna have to do is we're gonna go right ahead and clean it so we're gonna clean and we're going to go ahead and create partition primary. And here we're going to go ahead and set size. Uh, for the size, I'm just going to do 10 gigs. So there we go. And as you can see, it, uh, it did a partition for 10 gigs. So there we go. So let's go ahead and do the other one. So we'll just do create partition primary. And this time I'm just going to leave it like that. I'm not going to put a size. So what will happen is as soon as this runs, it's going to go ahead and take the complete or whatever is left of the hard drive. So we're going to go ahead and run it. As you can see, it took the rest of the hard drive. Now, um, a little note. You, uh, you can have four uh, primary partitions on a hard drive, so you can actually create four partitions. Uh, I just want to, you know, put that, you know, you know, let everybody know about that. So, all right. So this time it's going to be uh, a different command. Now that we created partitions, we're going to list volume, and as you can see we see volume six and volume seven, which would be six would be the 10 gigs that I created and volume seven would be the other partition. So I wanna go ahead and I'm gonna start with six. So we're gonna do select, oops, not disc. We're gonna do volume six and list volume. And as you can see that little star is selected on volume six. All right, so here um, I'm going to go ahead and give it a drive letter. So we're going to do assign letter equals, we'll do G. There we go, we'll do G. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and format it. So we want to do format FS equals NTFS. Uh, we'll do label equals, we'll just do one. And of course, quick. Gonna wait a little bit. And as you can see, there it is. So it labeled it one, gave it the drive letter G, and it is formatted to NTFS. So we'll just go ahead and finish off the last partition. So we'll do select volume seven. And like always, just verify. Nothing wrong with that. Volume seven, so we're gonna go ahead and hit assign letter equals, I'll do H this time, why not? And of course, last command format, FS equals NTFS, label equals two, quick. There we 
we go. All right. So as you can see, it created one. Uh, one partition is one and drive letter G. Uh, second partition would be two, uh, drive letter H. And of course, both of them are NTFS. All right. So if we go, uh, let's see. Let's do File Explorer just so I can show everybody. And as you can see right here, let's make it. You have partition. Here's one partition, and here's the second partition. Well, uh, I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one.